what's better than 02? 03. Let's talk about the new DJI 03. What is it exactly? So imagine you take a Nevada and you strip it down and what you're gonna take out is that small little camera and that's what you get. 4K, 60 frames per second, one over one seven inch sensor, which is pretty big for such a small camera. And you also have that big wide 155 field of view. And that's just gonna open new opportunities because you don't have to necessarily now buy an action camera to get decent quality. And you're gonna save a lot of weight on your craft and that makes your craft more powerful and also more efficient. Let's talk about the video transmission of the new O3. I think that's what we are most interested in. Now out of the O3, we get 30 milliseconds. We have up to 50 megabits bitrate, which we had before and, and proved to be amazing. We get up to 10 kilometers uh, in the FCC mode. And through the goggles now we can enjoy 1080p, 100 Hertz. So the image quality, I tested it, it's just absolutely amazing. Even I flew far and my megabits dropped. It's so much better than on the old air unit. Then also now we have 33 dBm and that's two watts. So we have double the output power compared to the old air unit. And now you can also choose between 40, 20 and 10 megahertz bandwidth. So the throughput you can change depending on your scenario with more interference or less interference. Another big advantage of the O3 system is that you have multiple stabilization opportunities and that's exactly what we FPV pilot need. So you can either internal stabilize the footage using Rocksteady or you can take that footage and external stabilize it with a program like Gyroflow because the new camera records IMU data, so it's gyro data and that proved to be like the best stabilization at least on FPV drones where you need super smooth footage. And here we are in the FPV Frame Factory, a place where drones are designed, built and tested. And today with me, Laurin, an amazing drone a designer with a lot of experience and we have been working a lot over the last two years. And today the goal is to take this amazing Flowix V2 and make it ready for the new DJI O3 because a few things have to be changed. The Air Unique itself got smaller, the camera, and we also have to design a few 3D parts to actually mount these air unit and camera properly. Um, yeah, so that's the goal for today. And we do this here in the Fusion, a program where 3D parts are designed and then we're gonna take them to the 3D printer. They will be printed out and tested in the field. And here we are now, drone fully assembled. You can see here, nice 3D print for the antenna which protects the wire, air unit, now small has also uh, its place here nicely embedded and then a 3D print for the camera which allows you to put on the ND filter which is slightly bigger. So shall we test in the field? I'm pretty stoked. 